Hey everybody, Ben Adams here, and I'm going to have a very basic color correcting tutorial in Adobe After Effects. When you're color correcting, you want to use the image that has the most information in it. So when you're shooting with your camera, make sure to turn the, if you can, turn the contrast down on your camera and the sharpness. Okay, so the highlights and the shadows don't get burnt out. So here I have an adjustment layer with color correction already on. I'll turn that on and you can see a big difference here. It's a lot sharper. There's a lot more true color. The sky is bluer. There's a lot more contrast in the image. So I'll turn that back off and that's the original image. As you can see here I have unsharp mask and then the color finesse. So first I'll start with the unsharp mask and what the unsharp mask does is it adds contrast to the edges of the image it's sort of a false sh sharpening so I like to have the amount down lower and then the radius up much higher as you can see in the image it gave it a lot more sharpness and more contrast turn it off and on so you can see the difference now you can really overdo this and give it a really gritty look and depending on what your look is you're looking for you'll adjust it and then I'll go to synthetics apertures color finesse and I'll load the interface and what you'll see starting out is this and I like to use a split resource or the split source so you can see on this half the original image and on this ha half the what you're editing side and I, I, I also use the RGB waveforms and as you can see here 0 is the true black and 100 is true highlight and anything above 100 is overexposed and anything below 0 or at 0 is completely black. As you can see here I have a flat image there's nothing below 0 and above 100 so I like to use curves so what I'll do is I'll take the shadow corner of the master and bring everything down to zero as close as I can then to even it out I will adjust each color individually okay so now these are about even and I'll do the same thing with the highlights take this corner drag it up to a hundred reds there but I want to drag the green up separately and the blue up se separately see as you can see now this half is a lot more um, contrasted and the colors are a lot truer and they're a lot more even if you go to the res if you go to the source that's the original and if you go to the result you can see the difference there okay okay that's color corrected and this is what it would look like with a little better color grading effect see I adjusted it to look the way I wanted to I added the aspect ratio of 2.35 which is the film aspect ratio and I have a little flare here to give it a, a little more filmic look so if you compare that to that it's a lot better looking if you guys have any questions you leave it down in the comment subscribe to my channel I'll have more tutorials later and if you have any questions or comments about my tutorial this is my first tutorial so let me know give me some good feedback uh, please don't just insult me that's not very mature but just let me know what you think and I hope I can help and I hope I can answer more questions for you if you have any questions beyond this point thanks bye